Hi, Famous Fido. I'm Paul. And I'm Jason, and we're Guardians of Brock. We chose to adopt a dog just to bring a little bit of extra love into our life and open our homes. And so many of them are in need of homes. Uh, but we had to realize the commitments and the responsibility. Uh, we had to find the right dog. Uh, luckily, we found Famous Fido Rescue. Um, and we chose them just because through the rescue, those dogs and animals really need homes. And that's why we went for an older dog, a senior dog, um, and one with special needs. Fido <clears throat> is very, very aware of the needs that their dogs and cats have. And Gloria does an amazing job of letting people know all the characteristics of the animals that are there and what they need. So we went to uh, Famous Fido, not expect, not knowing what to expect exactly, but we wanted to visit Brock just to see and get introduced to him and see how he reacted to us. Um, so we went there and we knew right away that we didn't want to try to pet him or pick him up or try to be friendly, we wanted him to come to us. So we did that bonding with him using food, which he readily, you know, he readily came to us when we had food, obviously. Um, each visit was a new experience. We did four different visits with Gloria, talking about all the different things that we needed to know about taking care of Brock, um, what his personality was like, um, and what kinds of things to expect from him, um, which we didn't take for granted at all. We never expected what it was gonna be like. We didn't know, we anticipated, we talked about it, but certainly we were, we knew we were in for some challenges. Um, during that visit with Gloria, we talked about what kinds of things that we would have to buy as far as supplies to take care of Brock, such as beds and such as certain kinds of foods, treats, um, vitamins, leashes, harnesses, if we could buy him a coat, those types of things. Um, you know, what kind of dog shampoo, what kind of brushes. Um, so we, she was very thorough in exactly what brands and what kinds of things that he would like. Um, and so we went out to Amazon and into PetSmart and did a lot of different um, shopping, comparison shopping from there. And we didn't have a Chihuahua in mind in particular. We were in an apartment. Uh, we wanted a smaller dog. We are at Lake uh, in Lakeview, we don't have a yard, so we knew we would have to walk the dog. And we knew that that would be a commitment and a time. And we had to work with our schedule to make sure to keep um, Brock on a set schedule and a set pattern because they do need that. They need a regular routine. Um, and he's, he's developed really well with that. His home life has been a lot of fun. He loves the walks. Um, he's had six a day so far. He averages. Um, he loves the lakefront. We just found that he loves to run through the taller grass, even though we always keep him on the harness, uh, the collar rather, um, and the harness. Not just like a leash, but the harness, so we have full support of him. Um, he's not really fond of the other dogs. He's more interested in the trees and just running through the grass. So he's actually a, a lot more active than what we thought he'd be. This is his downtime because he just had a long walk. Um, he was fantastic with his baths, but he has his personality so that we are learning about and we still have to be hesitant. He's learning our house, we're learning him. Um, it's not just a magic button and he's here and everything's fine. Um, you know, so it's, it's a process, but Gloria's been there the whole time. I've called several times, emailed videos, pictures, um, called her for advice. And um, that's another aspect of Famous Fido is that they are there for you, not just at the start, but even after. They're really devoted, Gloria, Ted, and the entire staff of Fido. So we want to encourage everybody to um, go ahead and support Famous Fido Rescue um, through donations, or just go and adopt a pet, um, you will not be disappointed. Thank you. 
and you can sponsor as well. Uh, you can volunteer time there. You can drop off food. Um, they have an Amazon wish list. And uh, for this event in particular, though, try to be as generous as you can. It will help other dogs and cats as well um, find as nice of a home as what we're trying to provide for our new uh, little boy here.